Sorry, did you get my new uniform? Kind of annoying if I didn't have the uh, reflective vest. I guess I just borrowed one from the store we have, but... Uh, I think that's... Okay, thank you, thank you. I'm gonna go and get that. Sorry, sorry. Alright, uh, so let's go and get my new uniform. Alright, it should be in here. Oh, yes, yes, okay. Alright, nice, 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 nice. Let's just go and get that. Finally, finally. I've been using the old ones we've had and in storage and they're not nice. Honestly, they're not really not nice. Um, they've been worn for so many times and they're barely replaced. So let's go and put my high-vis on there. Got two calls there. Let's actually go and check up on uh, the radio there. So we've got a traffic light, uh, traffic light outage on Main Street. Hey, do you want to head to that traffic light outage on Main Street? That should be pretty quick, right? Yeah, let's head over there. Okay, alright, uh, let's go and hop in actually. Uh, we've got another call, open car park near the dealership, traffic light outage, sorry, let me hop in actually and read the call as we go. Why have we got so many calls? Uh, well, all of a sudden, um, traffic light outages, is they're all just traffic light outages. Oh, there's a small, oh, there's a small collision as well. Uh, we may need to roll one or two more vehicles as well, but apparently there's a small collision on uh, Main Street. Haven't really got anything else, just basically people saying there's a traffic light outage and small collision. I'm not entirely sure how many vehicles we've got involved in this, but uh, let's just head over there. We've also got some local law enforcement, I guess they can send their assessment. Um, I'll keep on the line with FD in case we do have to call them. Okay, yeah, we've got, oh gosh, Tahoe's been lifted up or something. Alright, let's just go and arrive here. We may need EMS assistance. Okay, actually, I'm going to go and get, uh, go and call EMS. Alright, let's just top out, and we're going to move the vehicles into position. Alright, is everyone okay? Can you just step off the road? If you're able to, step off the road, please. Step off the road, come over here. It looks like we've got three or four vehicles involved in this collision here. Is there someone inside this vehicle? Hey, hey, you alright? You are you able to shift yourself over to this side? Uh, doesn't... Okay, this officer just came here, so they weren't involved in this. Right, there you go. Come on, let's get you around the other side and we'll get uh, EMS over here. Yeah, come and take a seat at this bus stop, actually. There you go. We've got a nice, nice wooden seat you can take. Uh, take a seat, then. There you go. All right, anything hurts? Uh, you're walking a bit funny, but anything hurts in particular? We've got three or four vehicles. Uh, yeah, three vehicles involved in the collision. Looks like the bank truck came to a stop. Doesn't look like they've got any damage. I think they may have... They may have just been able to avoid that, and they came to a stop to try and assist people. Um, where's the bank truck driver? Oh, hey there. Uh, is there anything in the back of your bank truck at the moment? Nothing right now. Alright, uh, okay. We'll get you moving soon enough. Uh, you weren't involved in the collision, right? Looks like you've managed to avoid it. Um, just going to pick up. Okay, yeah, sure. We'll get you on your way shortly. Let's just try and move these out of the way. If we got a tow, we've got a tow over here. Got a tow. Hey, sir, sorry, if you could just stay back for the moment. There's a lot of uh, shattered glass and... Uh, debris around. Yeah, so if you can just head over to the pavement or the sidewalk, just go and stand over there. Thank you, thank you. Alright, uh, we've got EMS, I believe, arriving. Not sure where they are. I uh, believe they were called, but yeah. EMS should be here shortly, so um, yeah, if you are injured, they can just take a quick look at you. Sorry, let's go and let them move the vehicle back. So we'll start off. Yeah, none of these vehicles are majorly impacted, but I believe there was a problem with the traffic lights. Uh, seems like the systems are back up and running, but. We'll have a look into that. Maybe some slight, uh, slight problems with the systems today. We've had that before, so not, not out of the uh, realm of possibilities that we've got some sort of system malfunction. Okay, I've just requested a tow, and they should be sending that over here now. Let's go ahead. I'll assist you in linking that up. All right, that's all attached to perfect. Vehicles in neutral, so you're ready to tow that whenever. Right, we've got another traffic light outage. Uh, so yeah, kind of the sun's going down now. Let's go and pull up here. All right, yeah, let's go and sort this out again. What is going on with these traffic lights? Dear me, we've got so many calls about them today. This is our third call today regarding traffic lights. Hi, uh, can you just explain to me what happened while I have a look at the um, power unit? Yeah, what happened here? Oh, did a police car? Oh, a police car went into the side. Oh wow. Okay, I thought that was. Oh, I thought the police were doing traffic control, but no, they went into the side of one of the vehicles there. Alright, uh, I'm going to have a look at this. We've got a lot of problems with them today. The lights are also going through some weird sequences really fast as well, so... Sorry, I'm... Yeah, let me have a look at this here, and I'm going to call our tech department, because there's obviously something going on. Uh, for the meantime, let's just assess the damage real quick. What, what's the damage look like? Police vehicle, though, or the police unit, they've got the push bar, so that kind of saved their vehicle, to be fair. Alright, um, situation's not looking too bad, police vehicle's got minimal damage and uh, we can probably tow, actually no, the, I think the postal vehicle's good enough just to drive it back to the impound, but 
we could always tow it. It's looking like a busy day for us here. Electrical appliances. What is going on with this? It's really something... It's really a problem with our systems today. We've got uh, traffic lights playing up in the city. Look at the calls we've got. Oh my gosh, we've got a lot of calls rolling in. So we've got this one, which was... Yeah, that was the electrical appliances. Looks like we've got two units um, uh, attached to that. But no one attached to this. Another light outside the... Another light out outside the bank. Hey, do you want to head to the bank? We've got a light out there. I think this is going to be a long night. It looks like we've got some really, really bad technical issues. I'm not sure if there's something wrong with the hard wiring, but it seems, I think it's, I think it's something to do with our, the technical issues with the, the grid. The, I think it's a technical issue due to the uh, linking up all of the traffic lights, but it's also some of the lights as well. So I don't quite understand, unless it's a electricity issue, uh, maybe something relating to the power plant, because that's where all the electricity for the city comes from. But I, I don't... Alright, let's keep it moving here. Uh, looks like we've... Yeah, I don't know what's going on here. They're red and green. I don't know what is going on here. Keep the traffic moving, please. Keep the traffic moving. Alright, maybe this will give us some indication of what's going on. But if we have a look inside... I'm going to go and use my key open that up. If you have a look inside, everything looks normal. All the lights are on. It says that everything's running smoothly, but... Oh, of course, we can see it's not, so... I'm not sure. I, I have a feeling this isn't a, yeah, I have a feeling this isn't a technical issue and more of a, a power failure. I feel like there's not enough power going through the lines and reaching some of the lights because our systems, I think, I, yeah, I think it's a power issue uh, that's causing all of this chaos around the city. Um, rush hour's coming up soon and that's just going to be chaos. Do the lights, I don't think so. I don't think the lights have a reserve battery. Um, all right, well, yeah, stay safe around the bank there. All right, let's head over to the power plant. We'll go and discuss with them if they've got any issues there regarding power. Um, basically, we're just looking to see if there's any issues at the power plant regarding um, how they're sending out the power, essentially. Because I feel like it's less of a systems problem. Yeah, we've got chaos at a lot of the intersections. Good news, though, we've got officers at a lot of the intersections managing uh, traffic there, so they're controlling traffic as much as they can. Okay, hello, hello. All right, we're from the Liberty County Department of Transportation. Have you had any problems with your systems today? We've had many power outages or... Okay, your system's, your system's completely down. Why are some lights on then? Well, what, is, what is going on? Why are... Because we're just having calls about some intersections, but not others. You have generators. Oh, and the generators are only pumping out to some some lights in certain lines. So, okay, so you're only pumping out to certain lines. All right, are you able to... You have a power... For, okay, all right. Are you able to show me a map of which lines are currently uh, being provided power so we can send any available units to the intersections that don't have power? Okay, yeah, thanks. All right, uh, they're just getting a map of uh, any locations that do and don't have uh, power because apparently all of the different intersections are on different grids. All right, thank you. Thank you, I'm going to take that. All right, uh, let's just go and... One second, we're going to uh, radio into all of the available units and just inform them of the locations. I wish you the best with fixing it. Do let us know once you've got generators back online, all right? Okay, thanks. No worries, no worries. Good to, uh, good to be back here. Well, not great circumstances, but good to see you. Okay. Let's head out. Uh, yeah, let's just do the best we can. Couple of calls here, dear me. Let's have a look at these calls. We've got one call currently. There's a light flickering near PD. All right, we've already got one responding unit, so I think that should be fine. Uh, we'll just go ahead and uh, drive around. If we get any other calls, we can attach ourselves to those, but for the moment, let's just find any light outages. There's nothing really we can do. It's not really like we can replace the bulbs. We just have to manage traffic until they get the generators back online. Hopefully, I'd say maybe only an hour and a half. Oh, yeah, okay, ahead of us. Running. All right, we've got a collision here. Okay, let's let's just go and set this up. We've got an officer behind us as well who can assist. Okay, everyone, can you get away, please? Everyone, back up. All right, come, come away if you can. It's you again. What in the world? All right, everyone, come sit down over here, please. Looks like the store's closed, so you can't go inside, but just sit down here. We've got another... I think we've got another crash light just down those roads there. Okay, everyone, off the road, please. Off the road. We've got to move these cars, please. Get these cars moving. These... Yeah, these lights are out. Okay, all right. Um, let me have a look at the box and see if we can fix anything. Where is this? Um... Where is a box for this intersection? Oh, it's across the road there. Okay, let's just come through. Alright, perfect. You grab your bag there. 
Uh, I'm just going to see how everyone's doing here. We've got officers, I'm not sure. EMS. EMS are probably overwhelmed at the moment. Okay, everyone just take a seat here. Take a seat, sorry. Make sure, make sure you're okay. If you, any of you are injured, then uh, just let us know. Police should have medic bags. No one inside the vehicles. Okay, yeah, let's just close this off here until we can get these moved. Alright, it doesn't look like they're too badly damaged. This one does look like it has front left axle damage here, but I guess, yeah, this um, this pickup should be able to move. Alright, yeah, bring your car down. Bring your car down there, please. Uh, okay, apparently there's an outage just over here, so we've got enough people um, at that. I'm just going to go and quickly jog over to see uh, if they've got enough uh, people managing that. But goodness me, it's crazy. Alright, else is it just send them diversion to the side road there. Uh, we've got EMS actually over here. It looks like this was a more severe crash, but the lights here are working. Okay, I believe the grid is back up and running now. Let's just have a look at our radio. Okay. Alright, a couple minutes and power should be back up. Alright, that's good. That is good. They're just doing a startup procedure for the generator skin. Alright, well, this is this is starting to look up. This is starting to look up again now. Let's just go and assist there because they've got uh, EMS at that collision by the parking garage. Hey, sorry. It looks like your vehicle, the front left um, actual tire has come off the axle and is damaged. So we're going to have to tow it, unfortunately. Uh, no, the front left, um, as you can see here. Yeah, if you if you look closely, it does look kind of like the tires turning, the wheels turning. But if you if you come back here and look underneath, you can see it's um, almost nearly completely detached from the axle. So we're going to have to tow it back to the plant. I believe the lights are being fixed. Yes, the lights. No, oh, I believe so. They said 500 seconds here. Power reverted equally. Oh yeah. Okay. They're starting up the power again. All right. Finally, we've got power back up and running to most of the locations. These lights. No. All right. We're still fixing these lights, but most of the lights around here seem to have power. Anyways, thank you so much for watching this video. Really hope you did enjoy. If you did, please do go and consider subscribing. It's help out the channel a lot. Massive thanks to everyone taking part in today's video. If you'd like to be in future videos, go and join my Discord servers and Robo Scoops. The links in the description below. Anyways, have a great day and I'll see you next one. Goodbye.